Hello guys, uh, welcome back to my channel, Prince Automation Destination. So in continuation to our previous discussion, where we discussed about what are feature files and what are step definitions. So, so the next step which would be arising in your mind is how Cucumber understand that where the feature file exists and where the step definition exists and during the running of test cases, how to make them bind with each other, right? so in order to bind with each other there is a provision within the cucumber okay so let me jump to the code uh, okay. so i'm going to the code side so in order to bind feature file with the step definitions so if uh, you can recall if you want to take a look like what are the feature files and step definitions you can look at my previous videos okay so this was the feature file which we defined and with respect to these feature steps we have written the step definitions as well right so in this uh, step definition, we written very basic at the rate uh, no, given when and then, right? Wherein I am writing some sample code at uh, test only. I am printing some console statement. But yeah, in the uh, next lecture or upcoming lecture, we will be writing code related to interaction with the UI using Selenium WebDriver. Okay. So now the question comes, we have feature file under this location and we have step definition under this location. So how Cucumber knows that corresponding to this particular feature file or feature step, I need to pick a particular step, right? So Cucumber has provided one provision, which is runner, right? So there, there can be two kinds of runners that we can use, that we can use from Java perspective. One is test engine and another is JUnit. In this case, I am going to discuss about JUnit and we are going to discuss on JUnit only for now. And later on, we will discuss on the challenges of JUnit using JUnit, right? And then we will discuss about integration of uh, Cucumber with test engine, right? So before we move on further, so we need one dependency which is responsible for execution or for letting Cucumber know that where my feature file exists and where my step definition exists. So we are uh, downloading this dependency. I'll be sharing this particular dependency in the description. So this is Cucumber JUnit, right? I'm using the latest versions of it. So if I go here, so what I have written, I have created one class UI Testener, and on top of it, I have provided one annotation at the rate run with. If you hover over here, Cucumber. So this is something belong to io.cucumber.junit uh, dependency only library. So at the rate run with also belong to this and Cucumber options are nothing but what are the options that we want to provide or that is going to help, help Cucumber understand what are the different options it has. So features is one option, glue is one option. There are several other options that we will be discussing in the upcoming sessions, right? When we'll be executing the test cases, okay? So now uh, we need to provide the location of features. So if you notice SRC, test resources features. So up till this location, I have provided the location. So under this, if uh, there would be any number of feature file, um, it uh, like Cucumber will understand that my feature file exists here and glue is a keyword which is responsible for um, uh, pointing to the step definitions so for step definition we just need to mention the package name right so under it whatever the step definition would be there it will automatically take care of it for example under step definitions there is locking step f so i am just pointing step f's folder right a package i mean so now if i'll run so in the previous time when we were running uh, we were uh, unable to run it right now if i'll try to run what will happen i need to simply right click on it on this this is a java java uh, code only right so i just need to right click on this and run it right so you notice both the test cases got executed right so in first test case if i go they are four steps one two three four and similarly in the second test case also there are four steps right so now if I go, if I notice these are four, right? And this is again four. These are some simple uh, steps which I mentioned, if you remember, right? So this is, uh, uh, we are printing. So it is to in, uh, in order to let you know that how the feature files are step and step definitions are binded with each other. This is the runner, which is responsible for why binding uh, feature file with the step definitions. So in the next uh, sessions, in the next session, I mean, we are going to discuss about how to run a specific test case, right? And what are the tags in Cucumber? So that is it uh, for this lecture. Uh, thank you for now.
please do like share and subscribe if you really find it useful thank you